Okay, so there's um, Kali Purple has been released. Um, if you go to Kali.org um, and click on blog, they uh, this blog post they talk about Kali Purple. And uh, to download it, what you can do is go to Kali.org, go to download, and here it is. Um, so I've downloaded it. It's in my uh, download folder. So I'm going to try to create a virtual machine with this. So. Other tools, uh, welcome, new. Okay, so I'm going to select the ISO file, other. Uh, here it is. So, Kelly, I'll copy this description right here. Kelly. Next. We'll give it 16 gigabytes of RAM. There, uh, give it two processors. 25 gigabytes, that's good. Next, finish. Start. I have the main Kali Linux right here. Graphical installer. English, United States, American English keyboard. So this is for defensive security. Uh, in, whereas Kali is for offensive security. Team Blue and is more defense and Team Red is more offense, I think. And then like Team Purple is like, if you just had like Team Red and Team Blue, then like one of them might not report something like the, the defense team might not report how they got hacked by the red team and the red team might not report like how they got stopped by the blue team when they were trying to hack and so team purple is there to try to kind of coordinate things to um, like when you have uh, okay, configured in the network please enter the host name for this system and I'll just go with Kali um, yeah I think I can leave this empty configure the network so I'm going to go with my full name, Peter Cullen Burberry. Continue. Uh, username, continue. Okay, so for this password, I'm going to pause the video um, because I don't want to display my password on the screen. Okay, so I've entered the password. I'm not going to show it in the clear on this video. But, um, click continue. I've stored it in KeyPass. I used 1Password's database. So I'm in Eastern Time. Detecting disks. Loading additional components. I uh, use entire disk. Uh, finish partitioning write changes to disk. This might take a while. Um, looks like it's going pretty fast, so um, I'm backing the base system. Well, in the meantime, I can um, 
be the release for Cali Purple. Cali Purple. We are leveling the playing field. Over the years, we have perfected what we have specialized in, offensive security. We are now starting to branch into a new area, defensive security. We are doing an initial technical preview pre-launch of Cali Purple. This is still in its infancy and is going to need time to mature, but you can start to see the direction Cali is expanding into. You can also be a part of helping to shape the direction. What is Cali Purple? The one-stop shop for blue and purple teams. Feeling red, feeling blue, Cali Purple, you do too. Let's see, is it done now? Remember what we did a decade ago with Cali Linux, or with Backtrack before that? We made offensive security accessible to everyone. No expensive licenses required, no need for commercial grade infrastructure, no writing code or compiling tools to make it all work, just download Cali Linux and do your thing. We're excited to start a new journey with the mission to do exactly the same for defensive security. Just download Cali Purple and do your thing. Cali Purple is starting out as a proof of concept, evolving into a framework, then a platform, just like how Cali is today. The goal is to make enterprise grade security accessible to everyone. What is in Cali Purple? On a higher level, Cali Purple consists of a reference architecture for the ultimate SOC in a box. Let's see, is it done now? It's done now. Uh, so, yeah, I'll just go with the defaults. Notice we have XFs, XF. CE, Kali's default desktop environment, um, install defensive tools by purpose, selecting the same has no effect, identify, protect, this is for the NIST CSF domain, protect, detect, respond, recover, okay, I'll keep reading, um, a reference architecture for the ultimate SOC in a box perfect for learning, practicing SOC analysis and threat hunting, security control design and testing, blue red team blue red purple teaming exercises, Cali spy versus spy com competitions, bare knuckle blue versus red, c protection of small to medium sized environments, over 100 defensive tools such as Archimeme full packet capture and analysis, cyber chef the complete cyber swiss army knife Elastic Security, Security Information and Event Management, GVM, Vulnerability Scanner, The Hive, Incident Response Platform, Malcom Network Analysis Traffic Tool Suite, Suricata, Intrusion Detection System, Zeek, another intrusion detection system, both have their use cases, and of course all the usual Kali tools, Defensive Tools Documentations, Pre-Generated Image, Kali Autopilot, and Attack Script Builder, Framework for Automated Attacks, See, is it done? Okay, it's still going. Cali Purple Hub for the community to share. Practice PCAPs. Cali Autopilot scripts for blue teaming exercises. Community Wiki. A defensive menu structure according to the NIST CFS National Institute of Standards and Technology Critical Infrastructure Cybersecurity. Identify, protect, detect, respond, recover. Cali Purple Discord channels for community collaboration and fun. And theme installer menu entries and, and XFCE. Now this is just the beginning of our journey. So yeah, screenshots. This is what it looks like. Some defensive tools. Elastic SIEM. Uh, hmm. uh, okay, so here's the documentation. Um, Arkeem, Cyberchef, The Hive, uh, okay well it looks like this is taking a while so uh, I'll pause the video. Alright so uh, I want to install the Grub Bootloader so I'm going to click continue. Um, and I want to click Dev SDA Selling Grub Bootloader Finishing the Finishing the installation
I'll pause it as it finishes. Okay, so um, it says installation is complete. Please click continue. Please choose continue to reboot. Rebooting. Requesting system reboot. So now I'll enter my username and I have to look up my password, so I'm going to pause that. Okay, I've entered my password. I think I entered it correctly. Oh, darn it. Okay, let me try that again. Okay, hopefully this should work. And it's working now. So here it is, Cali Purple. So let me put it in full screen. Let me do view, press host F. So let's see what we have here. We have terminal. Uh, boot terminal. Um, There's the boot terminal, um, the file manager, uh, text editor, web browser, let's see here. But what what else is specific to um, to Cali purple? So all applications. So for example, what about um, CyberChef? Hmm. Well, I guess they haven't added that yet. Um, but, uh, well, I'll just click uh, this one. Uh, Identify. Hmm. Protect. Detect. Respond. Recover. All right. Well, that's how to install um, Cali Purple. I'm going to shut the machine down now. Shut down.